welcome back to the show. I'm just cracking up because I cannot get enough of Fadili's voice today. He has a super cold and he sounds like a baby. <laughs> it's super hilarious. Anyway, back to the show. Welcome back. The hashtag is Rock254. Thank you so much for staying with us. If you're not familiar with the show now, my name is Philine. You can find me across all social media pages at Philine Jin. That's on Facebook, on Twitter, and on Instagram as well. And keep talking to us at Rock254. That's on Facebook and Twitter. And you can tag at Y254 channel as well. I can see Steve Anthony is tuned in. He's saying, loving the show, looking lovely as always. Philine Jin. And of course, hashtag Rock254. Thank you so much for watching that show that's on Twitter so keep talking to me when I come back I'll be sending you some love some shout outs but now back to the matter I told you we'll be having guests when we come back and I wasn't joking they are right here and they're ready to say hi so how are you guys doing you're well yeah I'm good. I'm good welcome I'm to good. the show it's good to have you um you know I just told you guys last minute I actually literally told them at 1 a.m last night <laughs> I'm like hey what's up you guys are coming through and they're like yeah what okay first of all who was I talking to? You're talking to Frank. Yeah, talking to Frank. To me, yeah. <laughs> Frank, we're gonna find me in one. Why are you up at one? <laughs> <laughs> I was practicing with this guy. <laughs> oh, oh, you're practicing. Yeah. That's why I was like, hey, I didn't even think you guys would be online. I thought you'll sit in the morning, then get back. So, hey, I'm like, you guys are. <laughs> but welcome to the show. So since you okay, your name is Frank. Yeah. So I think it's just gonna be fair. Turns in our way. I love who everybody introduces themselves, right? Yeah, sure. yeah. So yeah. Um, Frank Aiko uh, from Dead Skin Remedy Band, uh, lead vocals. All right. Preston, Dead Skin Remedy, and Clean. All right. And then? Um, Trieste, Zoth, I do the guitar part. Okay, I don't think I got your name, and I don't think the guys at home got that. So maybe just one more time. <laughs> okay. It's Trieste. Oh, it's Trieste. Yeah. Oh, all right. Zoth, I do the rhythm guitar. Rhythm guitar. Uh, DSR. Awesome. Um, and then Brian Saibo. <laughs> Brian, Brian has been here before though, yeah. but we just treat him like it's his first time. So just reintroduce <laughs> yourself. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just reintroduce yourself. I'm um, Brian Saibo, lead guitarist. Mm -hmm. Alright, lead guitarist. Yes, yeah. For that skin remedy. Yeah. Because yeah. let's just start with the name. Who's gonna speak for the band? Okay, about the, the name. The vocalist. Yeah, he came yeah, up with the name. <laughs> It's always the vocalist most of the time, so tell us about the name. Where did, the, did that come from, Dead Skin Remedy? Well, uh, to keep it short, it's just uh, the beauty of scars. Wow. Yeah. yeah. I didn't think, I think it was, it was going to be something deeper, but then it's still deep. If, you, if, you, if you'd like the deep yeah. part, go ahead, man. <laughs> Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Man. Yeah, he's the vocalist after all. Yeah. <laughs> Well, when you get a cut, uh, it's painful at first, and then yeah. it heals, and then an ugly scar comes up, but... You learn from it. You learn from it. Yeah. yeah. It's so. your remedy. So. Every scar has a story. I hear that. Yeah, yeah. Right. All right. So, um, tell us about the band. When did it cut? How was it founded, and by who, and how did you guys meet? Okay. Um, we actually started out with um, Frank. Mm -hmm. It was back in 2015. <laughs> 2015, when we were yeah. still in high school. Why? I guess that was Form 3. Uh -huh. yeah. So we just started out mm -hmm. as two guys, mm -hmm. just doing covers of popular rock songs. Yeah. Yeah, so we didn't have any instruments by then. Mm -hmm. um, we kept on. Then it was um, last year, yeah. around um, August, maybe. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I, I guess we were just an year old. Just one year. Yeah. Because it does Subway Kill. Yeah, we yeah, had a previous has. band. Oh, Subway Kill, and yeah. then now that's Kill yeah. Remedy. Yeah. Skin remedy. Yeah. Oh, that's something key. Yeah. Uh, amazing. So tell us about um, your your style, your style of music. How can you uh, describe yourself? I'd say our style is maybe garage, because mm -hmm. of the we do everything with acoustics when we start mm -hmm. off. Right. Then we transfer to electrics. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. the original versions are acoustics, kind of garage, then it goes to the electric, it goes grunge, right. or art rock. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
and uh, your influences. I don't know, yeah. So I think you're gonna take this <laughs> one. Who are some of your influences? Maybe as a band, or just you as a person, and then as a band. Who are some of the guys you guys really listen to? Okay, so I do uncleans for the band. Yeah. So basically, that metal and trash. Mm -hmm. Trash, yeah. yeah, wait for it. <laughs> <laughs> we also have another okay, band with the guys. The mic. Oh, yeah, okay, we also that. have another band with the guys mm -hmm. like uh, thrash metal band, yeah. Rot Paper Jesus side project. Right. But with their EP and their albums and everything going on, mm -hmm. just helping out with the fucking. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, right. yeah. 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 All right. It's still, it's still, it's still six p.m. Like, right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you're a rock star, so I get that. <laughs> I get that point. Yeah. All right. So um, tell tell me about your songs. Um, so far you have you released an EP just yeah. recently. Yeah. Okay. Now before you talk about the EP, I want to know about the who is the writer for the band? Who writes for the band? <laughs> the vocalist. I do most of the time. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Take yeah. us through the process of like you know there's writing music and then there's writing rock music. So, <laughs> yeah. are there any traditions you observe? Anything you have? To, like, uh, tell us about this. Just take us through that. All you know about is writing rock music. Yeah. Like yeah. music. Yeah. 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 That's about the process. Like, um, when are you inspired most? When you're with the guys? When you're alone? And what do you write about? I can say when we're in grip mode. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For someone who's tuning in for the first time, they have no idea what that means. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, yes. Yeah. Like, uh, maybe when we having a smoke, or maybe just just chilling. Yeah. yeah. That's when you're most inspired. Yeah. All right, I like that. Now, talk to us about the EP. How many songs and are uh, where are they available? Just tell us everything. What was were they inspired by? Ah uh, well. Uh, EP last night in Iraq crew mm. uh, has five songs yeah. uh, mostly influenced by the sound a uh, grunge mm. we've always loved grunge mm. from way back mm. so it's a cool one I guess <laughs> <laughs> he's not a talker at all he's yeah, like yeah, all right it's yeah, an yeah, EP maybe okay this song, maybe you can tell us about the songs there are five songs so what yeah. are you guys singing about is it a, about like um the daily life is it about what you're going through is it about what is it about each song has its own maybe meaning i can say yeah um but mostly mm -hmm. we can say it's about we're reflecting much on how the conformist kind of way life is right yeah, and you should not subject yourself to the system. All right. Yeah. So where is your music available? Because I checked YouTube and I was like, ah, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so where can people find yeah, your we, music? We, we need a manager. Mm. Oh, you need a manager? <laughs> no. So, uh, okay, so let me just talk to... Hi, guys, if you're out there, you're watching your manager. And not just a manager who wants to be a bank manager. You know your job. You know, your job as a manager is very yeah. hard. You have to... Find them places to perform, make sure they, are, they eat before events, get them events, get them to studio on time. Money so, is the money. <laughs> you know, money is the money. Bring in the money before. Okay, see you what after gigs, the love you take your cut, no? Yeah. Get the gig first and then get your share from that. So, so if you know you can do a good job with that one. Yeah, there's an opportunity yeah. right here, yeah? yeah? They're looking for a manager. So, come through. Where do they find you? What's your social media? Um, social media, DSR. Mm -hmm. uh, at Dead Lords IG, mm -hmm. Twitter, Wolfungo uh, account at Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> I like how they're just trying to find it out. Oh, now they're like, do we have Twitter? <laughs> like, okay, they should, but you should get Twitter though. Yeah, yeah, we time. should. Yeah, I yeah. know some people who are really someone like Yvonne, and I know she's watching. Shout out to you, Yvonne. Do Yvonne. Heavy and the beast <laughs> yeah. watching. I know she's only on Twitter. She's not on Instagram. She's not on IG. Oh, no, she's not on Facebook either. So I get, I get. So you all need a Twitter account. Yeah. Uh, that manager yeah. maybe. <laughs> that manager should come up in a Twitter account. Yeah. So on Facebook it's uh, DSR. Yeah, DSR. Mm. On Instagram it's a Dead Lords. Right. Yeah, DSR Screen Remedy. All right. Can get. That's awesome. Now, um, there are, tell us about the scene. What do you guys think about the rock scene right now in uh, in Kenya? And uh, what are your ambitions as a band? I think the rock scene right now, mm -hmm. it's more rock than mm -hmm. metal. Mm -hmm. And uh, we need some metal vibe, like uh -huh. a metal DJ. I had Deno of 
I only destroyed this bling. He's a metal DJ, mm -hmm. us from Nairobi Metal Fest. Mm -hmm. So um, we need more metal in the boxing right now. That's we need more say. metal. Yeah. So you guys are, are you recruiting any metalhead out there can join you? <laughs> yeah, so uh, we have a band already, mm -hmm. Thrash Metal. Yeah. We have no drama yet. Yeah. Oh, yeah. so, but, but then, kuna kazi, hashtag iko kazi, yeah? <laughs> so, in need of a drummer and a manager, you guys, <laughs> the guys at home can see that. So, yeah. um, are you, okay, apart from the drummer and the manager, would you maybe expand, get more people to join the band? Like, like yeah, man, if we can get a violin, violin, yeah. something. Yeah, a violin, yeah. Yes. yeah we can, okay. like, do a mm -hmm. big set. Mm -hmm. It needs yeah. to be as brutal <laughs> as it can get. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so, have you guys performed anywhere so far? Yeah, we have, uh, we have performed at Dago's. Mm -hmm. That's yeah, been to that boys. Um, I think that was last month. Yeah. Crystal Axis had oh. a gig. It was a yeah. charity event. Yeah. We, were, yeah. we were supposed to perform at that show, right? Yeah. Yeah, but then you see yeah. the the manager has a. I don't want to see this. Huh? Oh, all right. There was just an yeah. issue. There was an issue yeah, yeah, for you were to issue. perform. Yeah. Uh, all right. So when's your when's your next gig and how how is it how is it performing out there? How how was the experience when performing? Yeah. Um, it wasn't such a big crowd. Mm -hmm. I can say like maybe over 15 people. Right. But the sound That's there was awesome. dope. The oh, sound was man, dope. we walked out <laughs> like yeah. we we almost did 10 songs, yeah, right? Man. Yeah, originals. They had to Whoa. stop us from playing. Yeah, the songs. man. What? <laughs> I know bands who play the line out of songs and then they have to start over again from the first song. So that if you say you are stuck from singing, <laughs> yeah. then that's really amazing. Yeah. And I'm sure the guys at home will be looking forward yeah. to hearing more from and me. So, yeah. You should come there at Dago's. It's a chill place. You can, yeah, Dago's is pretty cool. You can booze on stage. You can <laughs> smoke. Yeah. It's a. <laughs> and that was, oh, by the way, for, you, it has been, for people who it's in Dagoraiti, yeah, right? And government. people who think at it, oh, you know, the people have this notion like at it, you rockers are cool kids. You know, that was is just pretty chilled out. Because uh -huh. the first time I went, I was like, ah, are you guys sure? <laughs> <laughs> I sure this is the place. Like, I wasn't really sure, but it's really, really cool. And the people that come through, yeah, especially um, like, um, for lack of a better word, like, White folks, you find them hanging out there. Yeah. I love who you know, for the sleep in Flan is like, eh, this place is shady, so but it's so <laughs> cool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's what I like about rockers, just getting along and everything. Yeah. So, when's the album coming? Any, any plans? No? Dude. Yeah, it's the vocalist. Now, I have a I don't know what's wrong. Talk to us, tell us. Well, we plan to record two songs mm -hmm. each month mm -hmm. so probably oh this you've set that for yourself yeah, yeah that's schedule yeah. i like that i have a friend who's currently doing weekly vlogs on youtube so every week he has a new song out so you guys is monthly yeah. i like that so you have to keep to it like i, I the guys at home can see that so we can hold that against you so <laughs> next month if we don't have a new song we tell the guys they didn't drop a song. <laughs> Is that what you're saying, yeah? Yeah, sure. sure. So we have, we'll, we'll actually hold you accountable. Yeah, true. No worries. <laughs> you know, a funny fact, <laughs> when, when you're on grip mode, mm -hmm. we can actually make a whole album within five hours. That's Not true. to okay. brag. Not to brag. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. That's, no, that's but only. that's cool, you know. But one thing, now this TV, we need videos. So when are the videos dropping? For at least the EP songs yeah. first. Yeah. When are the videos coming? We have an idea for a new song, not mm -hmm. in the EP, Paralysis. Mm -hmm. yeah. We have been discussing it with Frank, so it was not there yesterday. Yeah. But uh, it's really simple, so mm -hmm. I think two months will be out. For it's gonna be a out. new song, a new video. A new song and a new video. Yeah. Even for the songs that are already out, you, you guys can do, even a, with just a phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even we're, the simplest video. We're actually planning yeah. on, we're going to Mombasa tomorrow. Uh -huh. So, like the scenery there, we're yeah. planning on taking some shots. Yeah, we have here. a camera, yeah. and we'll put the the videos. In. Yeah, just put the videos together yeah. and get us a video, and we'll be more than glad to play you right here on the show. Cause we're all about okay. that. We're all yeah. about growing the rock scene yeah. and just bringing more bands to you know on the limelight. We wanna take rock mainstream. And you're gonna do that without videos and more music, but you promised us more music and videos yeah. coming up. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so do yeah. you have any last remarks, any shout outs, anyone you want, anything you want to tell the guys at home before I let you guys go? 
Yeah, and I got salam. What you will do? Yeah, they put him down. You have to stop them. You have to stop them. Salim, 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 my little niece. Ah, nice. Love you all. Oh. <laughs> That's so sweet. Nairobi Metal Fest. Yes. Yeah. That's <laughs> coming up. <laughs> that is in September. But hey, guys, if you don't have your tickets, you have to get your tickets for the Metal Fest. It's going to be big. It's going to be a two day event at Crooked Cues, right? Yeah. And then we'll be performing. So if you want to see them on stage, you have to come through. All right. Any last remarks? Um, yeah, at Nairobi Metal Festival, yeah. I hope we'll get a slot. Yeah. No. Are you? It's already booked. Oh, 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 you say, oh it's full. It? Oh, oh. Oh, okay. don't worry, don't worry. It's you can a just... surprise band, so. Surprise? Yeah, yeah you know, yeah. it might be you guys. Yeah, yeah. It might be you guys, and I, I know I'll definitely show up. Even okay, regardless of whether you're playing or not, we still have to go yeah, up and it's still play. Yeah, it's yeah. rock, and I'm sure the guys at home would love that as well. Yeah. So, anything you wanna tell the guys? Yeah. Any shout outs? Swamna salamu fia. Uh, <laughs> come on, you rock star, still rock. Yeah, yeah man. Just, Keep it rock. Don't conform. Stuff is mm. coming up, man. Yeah. And metal, too. <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right, guys, that is Bad Skin Remedy. Make sure you follow what? them, talk what? to them, tag them, whatever it is, just talk to them. They're here to make sure the rock scene in Kenya grows. Because I know you guys have been asking, like, yo, do you even have any Kenyan bands? There are so many of them. And these are just coming up. This is like your first interview on TV, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah so they're just starting. So the next time they're here, they'll have like five hit songs. What? Yeah. <laughs> Yvon, Yvonne is watching, right? Yeah, Yvonne is watching. Yvonne, to have to my shows. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> 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 and the, for the fans at home, hashtag yeah. is to end the rock gigs. Yeah, make sure yeah. you show up. Don't just like at your watch. You have to show up to gigs as well. Yeah, now keep it YT254. The hashtag is rock tour 254 at feeling gin at rock tour 254 at YT54 channel. We're going to play their songs and then be back later to send you some love and uh, shout outs, right? Keep it YT254.